one of the tallest 130 pounders. Yeah. Show us how you should be fighting tall. When I'm fighting tall, normally I'm on the outside, you're here, I can sit back and right, you know, and fight my way between shots. I love to get in between shots. If I can make my way shots that, that really hurt people are shots in between shots. Oh, right hand, right. right. And catch you in between shots. Those are shots that do a lot of damage. Off the jab, nice little face, make your ways inside out, you know. And everything is just off the jab, start set from there. And that can drop everything long and hard and, and maintain keeping you at this point. My left hand is, is also like a rudder. You know, when you when you shoot left hooks and the guy rolls it, I can pull him by his head and maneuver him out. I can do whatever I want to Put do. Put my hair up now. <laughs> you know, that's that's what my left hand right. my left hand is, is used for a lot of things. I use it to keep a lot of range, a lot, even when I'm not using a jab, to where people think is a, yeah, I'm not using a jab, I'm still using that hand for a lot of things. And I can I can manipulate where a person's hand's gonna go, where I want you. So I can I can touch, I can feel, I can push, I can control the landscape. I, and, and then on top of that, I can sit back and off doing something like this, I can sit back and yeah, it turns shut off real good and easy. Because it's nice and comfortable, it feels good, you push over, you can drive in and turn these shots off. And you still have that power to leverage on the inside, on the short shots. How do you get how do you get that power being such a tall guy on the inside? I mean, when, when you're when you're on the inside, usually you think a short guy, he's he's, a, he's that's where he wants to be against Diego, but that's not the case. No, that's not the case. But I turn in on them. I sit back and turn off a lot of stuff, and I really put I put everything on I got. I mean, you're talking about 130 pounds, and I'm putting on every single shot. I turn, I sit down on my hooks, I drive my shots in right, and that's that's my whole thing. I gotta put them in there right, and then I'm placing them right. You know, you're talking about those, you hitting in those nice little sweet spots and those little areas, and you're going to back away. Where's where's your sweet uh, spot on the I body? I love the solar plex. I love the solar plex. And just because it's that muscle that your body can never, no matter how hard you work on, never can, can be strong. Use with the jab, or is that the right or no, either oh one? Oh, gosh, it's everything. It's everything. You can sit back and do so many things off that shot right down there. You can sit back and skip in easy. You can turn. You can make some good shots inside of the ball. Depending on what you're doing, what the guy's doing, how he's moving, you know. If, if, if he has to pull away from shots, you can sit back and so drive right hand. A key part of the Diego Corrales offense is, is body punch. A strong biker. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. that, that's how I mentally can. Lots of, lots of fighters, you mentally fatigue them by beating their body. You beat them, you kill the body, they'll die. That's all we're saying, all, and it's, it's a common fact. You sit back and beat a guy, beat a guy. A guy's in a brawl, beating, beating, he's tired, he's fatigued. Now it's, now it's me, he's the metal. And nine of ten, that's why I'm gonna get